Hello, and welcome to XCOM Enemy Within. Um, I'm a big fan of these XCOM games, and this expansion came out a while ago, and I'm a bit behind. Um, but I got it, and I never got to play it fully, so I thought, why not record it? And put it on there, and if you like it, I'll do more. Um, yeah, so just gonna pretty much go straight in. Don't know whether to go easy, normal, classic, if possible. It's been a while since I've played, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull this out and go easy. Alright, let's go. So yeah, like I said, expansion, but I didn't um see see it. Well I saw it come out and bought it and then never had the time to play it. But now I do, so I'm gonna do it. Um, and yeah. recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative, to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Good luck, Commander. Here we go. Right, so I'll choose my starting location. Um, North America, obviously. Aircraft weapons, less to purchase, build, maintain, which is always helpful. Labs, workshops in Europe. Foundry and officers, training school, 50 50% less cost. South America, autopsies and interrogations are completed instantly. That's a, that's a pretty OP one. All in, monthly XCOM funding increased by 30%. That's always a good one as well, actually. Um, I don't know, they're all quite good bonuses. Mm, perhaps, except maybe, maybe, maybe Asia. If I could speak properly, that'd be great. Um, so, I don't know where to go. Europe, South America, Africa. It's gonna save a lot of time researching. I'm not gonna go Europe. I've done that too many times before. Or America. It's gonna be between these two. I'm gonna go South America. Gonna save a lot of time on researching. And we'll stay in South America. Brazilian authorities have requested our help. So go. that's where we're going next. So we've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. Strike one, this is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. I've never played this game before or doesn't know. So that's another full cover. We can go there for half cover. Which is more likely to be hit. But. Moving! Move you to. The 
this way. Half Moving to position. And how wide this map is. Not that far. There's a meld over there we can see. So we need to move that way a little bit. Right, how wide is it this way actually? Not that wide. Okay, right. So you're gonna move this way too and go half I'm rolling! Moving out. Alien object in sight. There's two turns to get there. Yeah, there are two turns. Rolling out. Still no alien. Alien as if it's like that movie. Moving out! That's really great. I love that movie actually. Yeah, meaning to get alien isolation. Because what game that looks. What game? game. Affirmative. In sight. Alien life on Earth. We're witnessing something never before seen in recorded history. Their weapons appear to self-destruct when the operator dies. We should look closely for any fragments that could be salvaged for our own development programs. X-ray down. Australian Walter White. <laughs> okay, I haven't watched Breaking Bad, but I know that on the move. people's names and they make drugs. So, you know, I'm essentially an expert. I mean, he says, Joe Field. On my way. I'm not. Alright, I'm just gonna carry on. Excuse my really poorly poor. Aye, aye, Commander. I'll get him next time! Aye aye, Commander. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. What a misclick. Just, just, just run back to me.
That is not good. Round a bit. Okay, Headed there now. That is not good. On it. Guns dry. Damn it. Missed the target. On the move. Out there, strike one. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We can begin researching the newly recovered artifacts immediately. Jesus, that, uh, that turbine is intense. There's intense turbine right there. Oh, I know, it's that cement mix or something like that. Jesus. Okay. Commander to the research labs. Commander? I think I'm going to introduce me to everything as well. Here we go. Oh. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. Uh, no, I'm, doing, mate. I'm Central Officer Bradford. Oh, Bradford. My role in this project is twofold. Providing tactical support for our field operations. Okay. And keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Commander to the research labs. They want me to go to the, the labs, Bradford, labs. not to your this, this soldier who needs to get promoted. Impressive work, Commander. Three of them do. Our soldiers have to be feeling good after a mission like that. Ronan Keating, and what an excellent name. Zizu. I mean, I'm not even going to change that. That's great. Just like it sounds, the support class provides that intangible edge our squads need. They make everyone around them better. The heavy weapons specialist provides a crucial service to the squad. With the rocket launcher in tow, there are demolitions experts. The assault class serves as our front line. They're the first ones into a fight, and the last ones out. The recovered artifacts are being unloaded, and the research team is waiting your orders. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs.